How do I replace the shaft in a Blue Sport gearbox? So you might want to replace the output shaft of your Blue Sport gearbox if you need it to be longer to put more items on the shaft or to reach something farther away, such as in our climber in a box. You need a two inch shaft to reach the bearing on the other side to support the shaft fully or you might want to replace it if you've damaged the original shaft. We have shaft sizes for one inch, which is the original, a two inch, and a three inch shaft. Also, if you can replicate this geometry with a mill and a lathe, you can make your own shaft at any length that you want. The first step would be to remove all four of these screws so that you can set the output plug aside and work on that. You can set the main body of the gearbox aside. We're only going to be working on this part. The next step is to get some snap ring pliers. I find the bent tips are useful, but straight tips will work fine too. I'll just make sure the tips will fit inside the holes in the snap ring. So you want to insert and put them in close mode so that when you squeeze they open and they auto close and squeeze until the ring can sort of shift around a little bit. And then you want to press on the back of the shaft and it'll fall out. And now you've got your snap ring. You can set your old shaft aside, bring in your new shaft, make sure you've got the orientation correct. The inside is the longer of the two bosses. I'll slide that over, take your snap ring, drop it over the new shaft and let go. Make sure it clicks into the groove by inspecting it and giving a good tug. You've now replaced the output shaft. If this is a new gearbox, this is a good opportunity to grease the internals and if it's a used gearbox, it's a good opportunity to inspect the gears and make sure everything still looks good. Once you've done that, you can just put the shaft on, make sure all the internals are seated correctly, and reinsert the bolts. And that's how you replace the shaft in a Blue Sport gearbox. Mm -hmm.